Right then, lads, welcome back to Kossi's Arsenal podcast. My name is Kossi, back again with another update. And this one is from Gianluca DiMazio. He cannot speak Tammy Abraham and the situation Tammy wants Arsenal. He is waiting for that offer, waiting for that Arsenal offer. Howsome hour as well. We are going to speak house in our again another player waiting for the Arsenal offer. And I'm asking myself, why don't these guys do other things? It looks like our priorities, it looks like the players we're going to sign in this summer have just been outlined. And I don't think Awa is part of them. And I don't think Tammy Abraham is part of them as well. But we shall also talk about another player uh, in the names of uh, uh, Vlahovic because if Arsenal tr- uh, to go for a striker, they might go for uh, 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 Vlahovic rather than Tammy Abraham. Who would you prefer? Would you go for Vla- uh, Vlahovic, Fiorentina, or would you actually go for the man himself, Tammy Abraham from Chelsea? Do smash a like on the video. Do subscribe to the channel. Um, after this video, the preview, our season preview is dropping. I've tried to talk about what I think Arsenal, uh, Arsenal season is going to be. And I predicted that we'll finish around 7th. Do you agree with me? Do you think Arsenal will finish around 7th? I, th- I said um, we can't finish top 6 if we do well. But if, 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 if we perform averagely, we are going to finish 7th. I think our, uh, our ceiling will be 5th. That is what I think. Anyway, you can correct me. You can challenge me in the comments. What do you think? Where do, we, where do you think we will finish next season? Let's get into it. Let's get the party started. We are sponsored by the beautiful people from One Expert. One Expert brings you all your latest betting odds um, and all the games they are brought to you. The um, uh, the Premier League, the Champions League, um, all your leagues. So make sure you do check out One Expert. Use promo code Cosi Media. You'll be able to find the latest, the latest um, in the world of betting. So let us try to dive into Tammy Abraham, uh, Dusan Vla- uh, Vlahovic. As well as Hausem Owa. Let me start with Owa because with Hausem Owa there is no big update, really. Uh, reports in France are suggesting that because there is no interest, there is not much interest now in, in Hausem Owa, Arsenal could actually, listen, Arsenal could actually get this man on a silver carpet. However, uh, many, uh, many reports still indicate Arsenal is not looking at Hausem Owa as their major target so the player Hausem Owa and his come are still waiting for a bid they're still waiting for Arsenal to come and sign the player it looks like Mikel Arteta has moved on it looks like Edu and the um and the transfer management on the or the board have actually moved on from Hausem Owa he's not really part of our urgent ta- you know targets it looks like Arsenal want to get in a right back. They want to get in a, uh, a decent goalkeeper uh, to back up Ban Leno and also an attacking midfield, just like the AFC Bell confirmed. Our priorities in the remaining days of the summer are a right back situation, a goalkeeper, backup goalkeeper, as well as James Madison or Martin Orega. Those are the four players we are actually looking at. Those are the four main targets. In terms of how some are, the players still waiting for, for that offer. I think it might not happen and I, I you know I, I I only get it when Arsenal actually move away or walk away from uh, from house Awa. they feel like they feel like the player treated them as 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 as, as a third or fourth option like if Juve don't side me, if Aleko Madrid don't side me, um, if Bayern and and, and, and and Madrid and Barcelona don't want me, then I'll, I'll just go for Arsenal. I think that is what Arsenal feel. And that's what the likes of Mikel feel. Uh, and they feel the player does not have that commitment. He doesn't have that, you know, th- that, that joy, you know, to join Arsenal. He doesn't actually have that, uh, you know, th- th- that, you know, th- that, you know, p- you know, motive of joining Arsenal at his priorities. So, Arsenal... Will they sign Hausem Awa? It, it, it depends a lot. But at the moment, Hausem Awa waiting for Arsenal move, it might not happen. And I'm saying this, it might not happen because our transfer priorities are very different and we need a lot of time to deal with them, especially James Madison, and we have less time. So don't be surprised in this summer if Hausem Awa deal is actually off. Away from that, still talking about players that are waiting for a move and want to join Arsenal and they're pushing for a move to join for us to join to uh, to join Arsenal is Tammy Abraham. Now we have spoken about Tammy 
on a couple of occasions and the reason as to why i decided to talk about tammy abraham is uh genluca dimazio okay genluca dimazio um italian journalist top top man top top journalist has been speaking consec you know, con you know consistently um and consecutively about uh tammy abraham you know in, in the past 72 hours now what do you know about tammy is atlanta or Atalanta wanted the player um, and they were ready to make you know to make him their record signing however that was on that was on one condition if Inter Milan right uh, if Inter Milan had uh, had gone for uh, Duzan Zapata that is it if if Zapata had gone to Inter Milan to replace uh, uh, Romelu Lukaku, then Atlanta would have signed in Tammy Abraham. Now it looks like Inter Milan, after selling Romelu Lukaku um, to Chelsea for hundred plus million, they have decided to go for Edin Dzeko from Roma, and that is why Atlanta have actually pulled out of the race to sign uh, Tammy Abraham at the moment, according to the information I'm getting. However, we are not competitionless it is not free we are not competition free in this one after roma after roma receiving interest from uh from 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 inter milan that they would want to sign in their biggest man in terms of uh eddie uh, Ed Ed zeko roma have decided that they will want to get tammy abraham from arsenal interesting isn't it really really interesting stuff really interesting stuff so sorry not from arsenal but from chelsea so roma want to get in um tammy abraham uh from chelsea to replace edin zeko who, who who might be moving to um inter milan however tammy abraham is still waiting and tammy abraham wants to join arsenal it remains to be seen if arsenal will actually go for tammy abraham because at the moment arsenal know that a striker is not on our priority list and everybody should know Arsenal are not looking at a striker at the moment as a big priority we are looking at two positions a goalkeeper and an attacking midfielder we might actually retain right back Hector Bellerin and deal with that maybe in the coming summer so in the coming summer expect a central midfielder uh, to dominate the rumors and um, a right back to dominate the rumors I'm not saying to dominate to sign for Arsenal I'm saying to dominate the rumors you know Arsenal with the rumors right so um at the moment, Tammy wants to join Arsenal, the same as Hossem Awa, but they'll have to wait. They'll have to wait. Arsenal will decide in the later days of the summer, after getting Madison, after getting um, Aaron Ramsdale, after getting in, after settling the right back situation, whether we will need to get in a striker or not. And one thing, uh, one, one other thing I'll say about Arsenal getting in a striker is. It depends so much on Alexander Lacazette. At the moment, it is only Al Aleko Madrid that have set their eyes on Alexander Lacazette. Will Lutaro Martinez now, um, you know, set to stay at Inter Milan because Inter Milan are reportedly asking for um, a figure in excess of 90 million euros. So if, if he stays, if he stays at at, um, at Inter Milan, maybe Aleko Madrid could come to uh, to, to 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 get Alexander Lacazette. Sorry, Aleko Madrid could come to get um, Alexander Lacazette. But if they do not um, come for Alexander Lacazette and Lacazette stays for another season, then the likes of Tammy Abraham and Vlahovic will not actually join Arsenal in the summer. This is what I think about it. I think Arsenal are genuinely interested in Tammy Abraham. I think they are also genuinely interested in James Madison. And they'll have to decide what one deal to do at a time. I think James Madison is the deal we are going for. I think Tammy Abraham and the striking situation will be dealt with Arsenal. Um, you know, but, you know, will dealt with by Arsenal in the next summer. So, to put it right, Tammy Abraham could join Arsenal if a loan deal is available and Alexander Lacazette leaves. I see very little chances of Alexander Lacazette leaving this uh, in this summer. I see high chances of um, Arsenal getting in a, a, a midfielder and retaining the striker partnership of Aubameyang and Alexander Lacazette. What do you think about Tammy Abraham? Should he wait or should he move on? My opinion is he should move on. The likes of Southampton are interested. Um, Southampton obviously have lost their, their best striker, uh, Danny Ings, to Aston Villa. So they need to get in a striker. Um, for me, moving to Roma wouldn't be the best advice. Of course, if he wants to replicate uh, what Lukaku has done in Italy, maybe, but you don't, you're not going to get it at Roma, are you? I'm not really sure about that. So, um, I think Tammy should stay in the Premier League, 
play football Southampton. You're going to be a main striker, bro. You're going to be a main striker there. You're going to get a little playing time. You're going to play 35 games in a season. And you're going to bang for them 12 or 13 or, or 13 or 15 goals in a season. And you're going to be a hero. That's what you want. You're going to be, you're going to bang 15 goals. And Southgate is going to call you up for England. That is what you want in the world, in, in the coming World Cup. That's what I think. So at the moment, um, Arsenal interested in Dusan uh, Vlahovic. I don't think Vlahovic move is going to happen. Um, as well as Tamir Abraham. Tammy Abraham is our priority. He wants Arsenal. But at the moment, I don't see that happen. According to Gianluca, he wants, uh, you know, he is wanted by Roma. But he's prioritizing a move to Arsenal. I'll speak to you in the next one. Make sure you smash a like on the video. And we shall meet at 6 in the live stream.